chapter related to this topic is coming. What is mapping? Mapping is the value. Use this one concept to set A, and mm. it calls it. Okay. This is not audible, sir. Hello. Hello. Yeah, now is it fine? Yes, sir, yes, sir. Okay, now you can see that every input has an output. If every ah. input has an output, individual independent output, this is called one to one mapping. Okay. Okay. Suppose okay. for one there's a value, suppose A, for two there's a value, suppose B, C. There is a suppose C for four. That suppose D. Okay. Each individual value you are getting. So one, one doubt. Yes. Uh, in uh, certain cases, we'll have to assume the values also. No. No, no. You don't have to assume the value. There will be some certain relation. I'm going to talk about that. Wait. Just wait. Okay. Let me give an example. Okay. So if I'm going to take an uh, take a value, suppose I'm going to take one, two, and three. This is a set A. And there is a set B, mm. and the relation uh, between this two set is square of number. Suppose whatever is the value, you will square of the number. So one square okay. will be one, two square will be four, three square will be nine. So this one is okay. each individual input has an one output. So this will be one to one mapping. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Now yeah, coming to the next one. Suppose the second. Second pattern, second type. Mm -hmm. There's a set, and there's another set is I'm taking. A is called as input, and B is called output. So in input, mm -hmm. suppose suppose each individual value, mm -hmm. okay, each individual value has many output. Okay. Okay. So there's many output. So that time we'll call it as uh, uh, one. If one input has many outputs, it's called one to many mapping. OK. Example, suppose for one, if you put one and you are getting three values, suppose A, uh -huh. B, C. OK, it's not necessary that two and three also should have a value. It may not okay. have. So that okay. is one, one to many, uh, one to many mapping. So there, if suppose uh, two has an output that is called A, three has uh -huh. one to C. Okay. For example, uh -huh. if I'm going to take some numerical example, and always they are connected with a relation. Okay. Suppose hmm. I'm going to take a value square root of value. Square root of the value. Suppose this four. Four square root means it should be plus two minus two, right? Yes, sir. If I take nine, so it should be plus three and minus three. So it is one, two, many. Yes, sir. Okay. One to yes, many. Yes, sir. Next one is if I'm going to talk about the third pattern. Third one. Third one we are going to talk about if many values, many input has one output, many input. Suppose okay. one, two, three, many input has only one output. Suppose this is okay. only output A. Okay. okay. This is called many to one. One output. Okay. Many to okay. one map. So okay. these are the things, so they should have a relation over here. So based on the relation, okay. each uh, different many input has one output. OK, OK. For example, for example, if I am going to if I'm going to take an example, suppose. Just a minute. <laughs> Let me think an example. Uh, suppose we are going to take only this output, right? One output. Uh, suppose 
suppose the output is output is what should I write? Mm, output is zero. So okay. this is an operation. Suppose it is there that whatever is the value x minus uh, the same bit. This is the relation. Okay. So, so one minus one zero, two minus two zero, three minus three zero. So many, many to one. Okay. Okay. Understood, sir. Okay. Like this, some relation will be there. Not exactly. I am saying x minus x. Something will be there. Some relation. So if you find these are the three types. One is uh, one to one, one to many, yes. and many to one. Okay. This is okay. called uh, mapping. So next, from the concept of mapping, there, there is a call coming. Uh, this is called function. Now, what is function? Function is a mapping from domain to range. Now I use the new terminology: is domain and range. What is domain and range? Okay. Okay. Now, domain to range. I said. Now, what is this? Domain means input. Hmm. Okay. And range means output. Okay. Okay. So, okay. nothing but it is a mapping. It is a mapping from domain. Okay, we are denoting function d arrow. Okay, now okay. what is this? Now take an example. Take it an example. Suppose I am oh. example that f x we denote it as f x equals to x plus one. So whatever value you will put, suppose if I put one, I will get one plus one. This is the relation mm -hmm. over here. So one plus one is two. If I put two, okay. two plus one is three. Okay. Seven plus one is eight. So okay. my domain will be my domain mm. be one, two, seven, and my range will be two, three, and eight. Okay. 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 So this is okay. the way to find out what is a function. So okay. next class we are going to discuss and do some problem on okay. main average. Right,